Entry door camber. Entry door camber is an easily overlooked detail of a lipper entry door, but it is a detail that means the difference between your door sealing and preventing water intrusion and it not. These doors are designed to have the top and bottom corner meet the frame before the center. And this creates extra pressure on the seal and seals the door to prevent water intrusion. To find an entry door's camber, you open your door, remove the screen door, take a straight edge that spans the length of the entry door, place the straight edge on the interior side of the entry door, and you'll be looking for a gap between the straight edge and the entry door. This gap right here should be between one eighth of an inch and one quarter of an inch. There's a few different situations you can run into when checking the camber of your entry door. You can have too much positive camber where that gap is larger than a quarter inch. You can have little or no camber where this door is flat or below an eighth inch gap or you can have negative camber where the top and bottom corners are flaring away from the straight edge. The camber of the entry door can be adjusted and you can use the LCI adjustment tool to adjust the entry door's camber. To add positive camber or to reverse negative camber, you place the legs of the tool on the outside of the entry door and you place the adjustment as close to the latch as you can. And you tighten this pressure adjustment until you see a slight bow of this door. This will reverse negative camber and add more positive camber. Reversing negative camber will require the greatest amount of adjustment and this should be done slowly and you should periodically stop and check your measurements throughout this adjustment process by removing this and again measuring with the straight edge and the tape measure. If you need to remove excess positive camber, you flip the tool around, placing the legs on the interior of the door And again, placing the pressure adjustment as close to the latch system as possible, but not directly on top of that handle. And you'll tighten this until you see a slight bow of the door. And then again, stop and periodically check the door to see if you've reached the optimal positive camber. Adjusting the door slowly and in small increments is best for the door and will remove the excess stress that you are placing on these components. If you are a dealership or a service center, you can adjust and calibrate these locking nuts to your preferred measurement. This will standardize your adjustment procedure and to do that you place your first locking nut to your preferred stop point, and then you will take your second and place it directly behind that first. And then you will take your wrenches and hold the first one in place and tighten the second nut against the back to create the lock. Using this LCI camber adjustment tool will help you mitigate unnecessary part replacement and standardize the procedure of camber adjustment for entry doors.